All right, everyone, get your foil hats out because here's another rumor from the internet, but this time it's in the Star Wars universe. And the rumor today is that Lucasfilm may be considering Michael B. Jordan for the new Boba Fett and the Boba Fett and Han Solo movie that is supposed to be coming out in 2018 directed and written by Phil Lord and Chris Miller, the minds behind the Jump Street movies with Channing Tatum and Jonah Hill and the Lego movie. Now, of course, you know who Michael B. Jordan is. Everybody knows who Michael B. Jordan is. He is most known for his role in Fruitvale Station, for the cool funny guy in Chronicle, for his upcoming movie, Creed, and also for being the best QB that East Dylan Hyatt has ever seen on Friday Night Lights. Now this rumor came about because before choosing Furious 8 as his next project, Straight Outta Compton director F. Gary Gray was under consideration for directing the Boba Fett and Han Solo movie until they chose Lord and Miller. But because of this, Lucasfilm was at one point considering Michael B. Jordan for the role as the new Boba Fett, but it's still up in the air according to the report that he could be the new Boba Fett. Now you might be wondering, we've already seen who Boba Fett was when he was a little kid in Star Wars Attack of the Clones. I know maybe some of you don't remember because you erased the prequels from your memory. It's okay because there was rumors before that there would be someone else wearing the Boba Fett armor and that this movie, this Boba Fett and Han Solo movie would take place after the events of Return of the Jedi when Boba Fett of course fell into that hole. Now there are a lot of people who may not like this news mostly because they like the mystery of not knowing who is under the Boba Fett armor. Of course yeah we saw him in Attack of the Clones but he was just a little kid. We didn't know who he was as an adult. But if they do choose someone like Michael B. Jordan or if it is Michael B. Jordan as the new Boba Fett and it's just someone else wearing the armor then you can have that character get a personality. Because in the original trilogy, and no one can deny this, Boba Fett did not have a personality. He was really just a hired gun. He had cool armor. And me personally, that's why I think he became so popular because he had cool armor. Now, of course, people will argue that Boba Fett didn't really do that much in the original trilogy. But of course, on the flip side, people will argue that he did most, or not even the most, but he did do a lot in the original trilogy. And it just goes back and forth. But me personally... I love this. I think Michael B. Jordan is such a great actor from first seeing him on Friday Night Lights and now to his upcoming movie Creed, which I'm really looking forward to. I think he is a great young actor and getting him for such a movie, especially with this whole Star Wars bonanza coming back and taking away the stench of the prequels, Lord and Miller, who are geniuses at directing and writing and, you know, just make pure gold out of what they create. This just all around sounds awesome, great. I would be happy for this because that movie won't be coming out until 2018 so we won't know for a while what you know who's going to be in the movie and the way the direction of the movie will go all of this is just rumor and a little bit of speculation but I'm excited to see how this movie will turn out eventually. Hey guys, Joel here reminding you that this video was made possible thanks to our many great patrons. If you want to become a patron and get exclusive comic book cast content, then click the Patreon link below and see how you can help us bring you the content you've come to love. Every little bit helps, and thanks for listening.